for the Gospel of Matthew on this Thursday. Ready? Thursday of this month. And Jesus said to his disciples, Stay awake, for you do not know on which the day your Lord will come. Be sure of this. If the master of the house had known the hour of night when the thief was coming, he would have stayed awake and not let his house be broken into. So you too must also be prepared. For now you do not expect the Son of Man will come. Most of us people in our life do not expect the second coming probably. I don't think so. I think somehow we believe that we will, you know, life of the world will go on. And although others do feel differently. But uh, death is something that you can never be uh, too positive or short of, right? Anything can happen. It's in a way that we need to be ready each and every day. You never know. When I was in high school, uh, we had this, we call this five o'clock to six hour, the strict study hall. You had to do only schoolwork. You couldn't write any letters. I was in the seminary then. I was in high school. And you couldn't read novels. You had to do really strict homework. And uh, our principal, sort of dean of discipline, was Father Earl. And uh, he had this ability to uh, come and sneak in without being seen. There's a front door, and then the back, there was a back door. Even though the floors were wood, he was able, and he wasn't a thin man, to walk without being heard. So you would never even know he came in and he would come down in the back and also up the aisles. And all of a sudden, if you were not doing what we should be doing, you were caught. <laughs> and uh, he, had a, he put a little fur guard in you. You didn't want to mess with him. It was amazing how he would just creep in and you look up, oh my God, there he is looking at you. You know, you're 14, 15 years old. And back then, you know, had a different fear of those, your, your, your elders and your superiors. It's not like the second coming. You never know when he's going to appear. And when he does show up, you want to make sure you're working because you didn't want to, you didn't want to annoy him. Trust me. You didn't want to think they controlled your life. So each day, make the day, each day the best because we never know when the Lord's coming. Amen.